Hey, what's up guys? It's Lights here, and today I'm going to be talking to you about how you can prepare for the Taken King. Now, a bunch of people have already done videos on this, obviously. From We're a little late because shone, I've been busy. I, I just had my uh, two-year anniversary with my girlfriend, and so I haven't really had time. So, um, first thing that everyone's doing that I've seen and that I started doing was postmaster packages. Checking. Public events. Now I only have one on this character Goodbye. because this is the character that I haven't done it on the most. I've done it the most on my Titan, or no, my Hunter, even though this is my main. Um, I just oh happen dear. to do it on those characters mostly, but um, the public event packages, Checking you can do it once a day, and if you get gold tier, you get this package here, and if you open it up, when the Taken King comes, you'll get 2,500 XP. Now, because they're changing the way we level up in this game, it's going to be based on XP. So with each package, if you get 20, that'll be 20 times 2,500, which I think adds up to, I don't remember, but um, like 50,000 XP or 500,000 XP right there. I don't remember. 50,000. Yeah, something like that. I don't know. But with all that XP, with your new subclasses, because you rank up subclasses based on XP, if you remember, um, you're going to want to get those packages and then wait to open them until after you have your subclass unlocked. Now, all each done, done. character has its own special story mission for the subclass, so you want to start on one character, get the subclass, open up, it, let's say you have 15. Checking. It takes, it's like 13 days until Taken King. You have 13 of these if you start today. That's 13 times 2,500. You wait until you get your subclass, okay. then you open them all up. Then you go and you you had all these bounties completed yes. from the day before and you start edging your factions as you can see here my crucible is rank two almost three at rank three i will get a package my vanguard i'm actually going to put a bounty on that right now as soon as i swap over to a vanguard thing bounty accepted now, i'm not going to do that crucible one because that will put me over and i'll have to restart that but um, I will put it on my future war cult because I am working on edging my future war cult. That way, when the Taken King comes out, I can put one bounty here, one bounty here, one bounty here, and have one, two, three, four, five faction packages right away. Which, if the Taken King gear, like they are saying, if the greens, like the green engrams that you pick up off the ground, the green and blues, are better than our raid gear than we have now, and if fac faction packages give us legendaries, that's going to be insane. You'll be at a much higher advantage than everyone else. So, uh, oh, I keep forgetting to, to do that for my character. Or for Future War Cult. Um, next thing. I have heard that if you get Cryptarch packages and you do them right away, like let's say I rank him up to 54 right now. If you wait to open those Cryptarch packages the engrams don't actually roll until Underway. you open it so even though you get those cryptarch packages right now it could um roll into blues or legendaries into uh the taken king is what i've heard Food now don't quote me on that but it's a possibility now the second thing is do it on all your characters now, right now, that was my Warlock. That was my main character. As you saw, level 36, New Monarchy. I've been working on him a ton. This is my second character. My second to main character. It's my Titan. Now, I haven't been doing it very often because I've been trying to work on my Warlock, but I'm close to edging my Dead Orbit, and I have to edge my Vanguard. I'm not going to be able to get Crucible, Future Oracle, and New Monarchy all to almost rank 3, of the time or in the next week and a half it's just it's not going to be possible for me so i'm going to work on dead orbit and vanguard for the most part to get those packages all right now oh xylo what did you do xylo was on my account earlier today did you really just do this right now looks ugly why do you even have come on but um That's it for that character. Now, I have public event packages here, as you can see my Postmaster. 
that I've got two of them here. So I'm going to open those once I get my Titan subclass. And the same thing for my Hunter. Now, it's the best thing to do to wait until you get your subclass and then turn in all your bounties, get your faction packages, open all your public events. That way you can get, you can rank up so much faster. Now, I've heard it takes around 100 to 120,000 XP because if you look in one of the trailers Bungie released that shows uh, a portion of a leveling of someone leveling up and it shows like 2600 XP or something and it shows literally like a third of their bar going from level 35 to 36 now that's a that's not a ton of XP because that's a little over what a faction package gives you but it's still it takes less to go from level 39 to 40 is what I heard than it takes to go from level uh, 19 to 20. Oh, hey, I got a Thunderlord, but it's still a grind, nevertheless, so that's all I have for you guys today. Um, just work on edging. See, I'm, I have to, I really have to edge this. This is a lot of work, but the grind is, the grind is a good thing, but that's it. I'll talk to you guys in the next video.